Tales. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a tutorial on this Christmas makeup or holiday makeup look that I am showing you right here. It's very nice, elegant, simple. And here we go. So before I started, I primed my face with my Nick, Nicker New York primer. It's extra smoothing makeup primer. And this you can get from any um, beauty supply, I believe. And next I am going to brush my eyebrow and fill it in with my eye brush, uh, eyebrow brush. I'm going to try and list below all the brushes that I, I use. I got them from Amazon. I'm going to see if I can find the link and then I will list it below. I am also going to list below everything that I use in this video. So I'm just filling in my eyebrow with my uh, Define Align Maybelline New York Brownish Black Pencil. Then I am going to clean up my brow with my Ellie Girl Pro Concealer in the color medium beige. So after cleaning it, <coughs> I'm going to use my hands or fingers to just uh, clean up the concealer. Remember this uh, part you can always use brush as well. I just love using my fingers to do it. So next I am going to start with my eyebrow. And I'm going to just uh, prime that as well with uh, my LA Girl Pro Concealer, same color, medium beige. I'm going to put it all over my lid and I'm just going to blend it in. And I'm going to set that with my Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder. all over my lid and you can also color, co color correct with um, your concealer as well so if you have any dark spots that you want to cover oops I put a little bit too much for it. we're gonna blend it out and make it look good
brush and I'm going to put in my lid this color from my beauty beauty treats mate out eyelash or matte eyelash palette into the same palette and use that uh, purple, darker purple color into the corners of my eye to get a little darker. go in with a blending brush and blend every thing together so you don't see any touch line <coughs> then I am going to go in with my Eyeshadow and it's in the color Sweet Lust. It's a single palette, and I'm going to highlight my eyebrow bone with it. Blend everything out once again. Next, I am going to go in with my Color Tattoo 24 Hours Eyeshadow from Maybelline. And it's in the color Creamy Beige. I'm just going to base my lid with it. Or my crease with it. Just so that I can have some um, creamy base for the shadow that I will put on top. I cut my crease a little bit, not too um, deep or intense, very light cut crease. And then I'm going to go on my lid with the, uh, this palette that I got from Marshalls and it's a uh, Max Studio Baked Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm going to use that, um, Is it, it's not goldish, it's like fuchsia, very, very light fuchsia or pink. It's not silver as well. And I will just go in with my fingers and dab them onto the cream tattoo that I, I put on earlier or before that. And I'm just going to blend any hash line. And you can also clean up any mess that you have. If you have a clean brush, you can clean up this, that brush. And I'm just going to intensify the corner look with, um, same color, the purple that I I used there. I 
I am going to go in with my eyeliner. And the eyeliner that I am using today is the Sephora. Sephora Fine Line. And it's the 24-hour 24 uh, hour self liner. Extending my wing a little bit. Next, I am going to use this brown pencil. I got that from the Beauty Supply. It's a N NK lip pencil in the color Coco on my waterline. Then I'm going to go into my palette again and use that same uh, pink or berry, car uh, berry color that I use for my crease or my base and smudge that into my waterline. Now I'm going to go in with my mascara and I'm using the Love and Beauty by Forever 21 Mega Fiber Lash Mascara. going to start doing the face and I'm going to I'm trying this new um, Maybelline New York fit me and it's matte matte and polished foundation and the color I am using is the 355 coconut And I'm mixing that with my NARS foundation in the color New Guinea and put it all over my face. Then I am going to highlight my face and the concealers I am going to use here is uh, the NARS concealers and I'm going to use, I'm going to mix these two colors together and it's the caramel which is dark 2 and dark 1 biscuit. I'll just put one on top of the other. And I'm going to blend it out with my beauty blender.
Blend everything out. Then I am going to bake with my Sasha Buttercup Bed and Powder right on top of where I highlighted with the concealer. And I'm going to contour with my e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzing powder. And if you contour your nose and it's too harsh or too much of um, contouring powder, just blend it in with your hands or your fingers. Or you can go in with your um, go in with your beauty blender and blend it all up. <coughs> I am just placing a little bit of my Sasha Butter Cake uh, Buttercup Powder <laughs> setting under my contour so it would look a little um, nicer and sharp. Then I'm going to go in with my MAC Studio 6 powder in NW43 and blend everything out my face. Then I'm going to go in with my Makeup Forever Mascara, Sexy Lash Mascara, and I'm going to put that under my bottom lash. Then I'm going to highlight with my Sun Kiss Mineral Bronzer. I'm going to put some on my brow bone, my nose, upper lip, and then my cheek. And I'm going in with um, my Wet and Wild uh, blush in the color Heather Silk A32E. Since it's Christmas, I am using this red lipstick from LAC Matte Lipstick, and it's in the color Starlet or CML 470. And I'm lining my lips with the same brown 
pencil, the NK lip pencil in the color cocoa. I'm going to go in my water tear ducts with um, my MAC single palette in uh, Sweet Lust and put some right there and finally I am just going to spray my face with the Pure Bliss Makeup Setting Spray and here it is. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and support me by subscribing to my channel and sharing it. Thank you so much and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye bye.